I know that you yourself uh, have suffered great grief mm -hmm. just recently mm -hmm. with the loss of your mother. And mm -hmm. I'm sorry for your family's loss. Thank you. And I'm wondering how doing this show or any show, how art itself helps you deal with grief. Yeah. Um... <laughs> I love talking about it, by the way, so if I cry, it's only, like, mm -mm. It's only a beautiful thing. This is all the unexpressed love, right? The grief that will remain with us, you know, until we pass, because we didn't... We never get enough time with each other, right? Um, no matter if someone lives till 60, 15, or, you know, 99, so... I hope this grief stays with me because it's all the unexpressed love that I didn't get to, to tell her. And I told her every day. We all, we, we all told her every day. She was the best of us. I, I was able to step into this in a way where I could honor this incredible life of, of Jonathan Larson. And he was taken far too soon. He died at the age of 35 on the night of the first preview of Rent off Broadway at the New York Theatre Workshop. With some strange twist of fate that he was taken that soon. We dedicate this opening night and every performance to our friend, Jonathan Larson. We lost him. We all know somewhere deep down that life is sacred, life is short, and we better just be here as much as possible with each other, holding on to each other. And for me, I got to sing Jonathan Larson's unfinished song while simultaneously singing for my mother and her unfinished song. And I'm indebted to John, and I, I'm indebted to any, any, everyone who's brought me to this place so that I can, I can honor the most beautiful person that I've ever experienced in my life through my art and use it as a way to heal, use it as a way to sew up the wounds, because that's what we do, right? That's what we do. You, that's what you do every night. You sew up our wounds. You sew up our wounds. Both John and my mother were artists, and they were warriors for art. They knew the power of art, and they knew the power of leaving the world in a slightly more beautiful state than, than when they found it. So thank you for letting me talk about her, and thank you for letting me talk about her with my, my, two, my two guys up there as well. So thank you, Steve. Thank you for sharing it with us. Thanks, Patrick.